morning kids today we are going to read lesson number 17 ways to travel first of all we are going to know about the aim of the lesson the aim of the lesson is to know the importance of various means of transport so children let's start the chapter all of us go to meet our relatives using various means of transport yes we need to go from one place to another so the means of travel and carrying of goods from one place to another are called means of transport the means of transport are of three types land air and water transport so let's discuss in detail first is land transport roads connect different places and make it possible for us to travel from one place to another train buses trucks cars scooters can move only on land railway is the fastest and the cheapest means of transport on land it carries goods and people to longer distances in a short period of time so this is land transport now let's discuss about water transport water transport is the cheapest means of transport it does not need the laying of roads it is cheap but time consuming ships can carry heavy goods from one place to another and from one country to another boats are rowed by oars whereas steamers ships and motor boats have engine so ships steamers and boats are means of water transport so let's discuss about air transport air transport is the fastest means of transport the different means of air transport are aeroplane helicopter rocket etc air india and india's international airline has destination in every country traveling by air is the quickest way to travel this is all about air transport now children let's see animals use as a means of transport bullock carts horses mules elephants and camels were used as a means of transport in villages people used tractors tongas bicycles and bullock carts mostly camels are found in desert areas so these are the animals which are used as a means of transport so let's start do you know children ships called cargo carry goods from one place to another and children discovery was the first ship built specifically for scientific research into antarctica well children this is all about chapter number 17 ways to travel now read this chapter from your book and underline the difficult words thank you so much